special guest dropping in. Today we're joined by two fifths of the Saturdays, Molly King and Vanessa Wise. <laughs> Looking good. forward to seeing you. Now, are you as good at cooking as you are at singing? I think I'm quite good. Vanessa <laughs> is good. I am terrible. Are so, you? Yes. I'm looking forward to learning a lot. What sort of things do you ruin? I, I even burn toast. <laughs> and I, oh. I've broken the grill at home by keeping the door shut. It's all smashed the glass, so it's a nightmare for me. But Vanessa is very good. OK, good. So don't worry about it. You are, you are on the right show, girls. Don't worry about <laughs> it. <laughs> Leave it to me. <laughs> no, no, I mean the cooking. Yeah. <laughs> At the end of today's show, yeah, Gina will be cooking. I where to put these hands. <laughs> I think you do. <laughs> Yesterday, a part of one of the country's most successful girl bands, they've had 12 top 10 singles, three best-selling albums, and have even starred in their own reality series. Please welcome Molly King and Vanessa White. <laughs> Coming yeah, to the show. Welcome, Sorry. welcome. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Really good, really thank good. you. You How look you? gorgeous as oh, usual. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank now, we haven't got the rest of the crew, have no, we? Because there's no. um, the two of your band members have had babies. One is pregnant at the moment, so it's yes. baby central, isn't it? I know. We oh, feel like it's catching. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh my gosh. <laughs> Don't sit in that show, you're going to catch it. <laughs> <laughs> and do, what does it mean for the future of the Saturdays with Baby? Will you still be able to, will they be able to work and yeah. you just keep going as a group? They've all been yeah. amazing, right up to the pregnancy they've been in work like at work every single day until yeah. obviously they are given birth but yeah we so give them that day off we're like <laughs> oh that's so <laughs> nice of you oh, no. are you free in the evening though no. <laughs> you do work very hard this is when when you're in a girl band i guess there is always rehearsing and yeah. this yeah. and that yeah. Yeah, other people think that it's an easy thing they think it's you look yeah. beautiful yeah. and easy you go oh. everywhere but, yeah, it work hard. Hard. but you know the question is why uh, you called saturdays well, it's the funnest day of the week, yes, isn't it? Yes, exactly. Everyone's off school, you can go out. <laughs> yeah. But what about Wednesday? <laughs> well, I like Wednesday. Middle of the week, something okay. to look forward. Shall we change Friday. it? See, Fridays, for me, it would be much better than Saturdays. <laughs> yeah. Because Fridays is like, good, I've got the weekend Fridays to go for. Fridays is all right. Fridays, Fridays is all yeah. right, Friday too. Friday evenings like Friday. are good. Friday feeling, everybody talks about the Friday they feeling, do. don't That's they? Good. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, their name's the name, it's established. <laughs> their name's I'm kind of stuck with it now. Now, you've got a new single out as well. Yes, yes, we do, called Gentleman. Yeah. It came out on Sunday, so we're just sort of watching it in the charts at the moment. OK, well, we've yes, got a little yes. clip of the video. Ah. Here's Gentleman. Let's have a look. A gentleman is so 1995, so hard for a girl to find. A real husband so 1999, so hard for a girl to find. Because most dudes just hit it and quit it, and then they wonder why most girls just spit it. A gentleman so 1995, so hard for a girl to find. <laughs> American sort of sound, it's really catchy. It it's makes you really want to move. It's yeah, good. It does. For us, I saw yeah, one of you fun. hovering the grass. Why is that? <laughs> no, no, no. One was oh, hovering. Yes. yes. Why would you want to hover the grass? <laughs> oh, no. It we'll just, just looks pick cool. Up any extra leaves? Any extra leaves? Yeah. yeah. So just tell us when you're out, when is your album out and when is the tour? The album comes out later in the year, probably around October. We'll have another single before that, and then we go on tour at the start of next year. Fantastic. So, well, yeah. good luck with that. Thank uh, you, ladies and gentlemen. They're sticking around with us, Molly and Vanessa. Thank you. Well, well. I definitely want to come on the tour. Oh, yeah. you got oh, the whole thing. Yeah, for the whole thing, <laughs> just to be there and do the uh, cooking yes, for you guys. Yes, we'd love that. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do that. No, I said yes because of excitement, <laughs> not like that. <laughs> girls, and what I'm going to prepare if I'm coming on the tour with you is yes. uh, uh, sticky banana and chocolate oh. tarts. Oh, my God. I think I've got the job. I think I've got I the job. I think you're in there. Okay. <laughs> I think now, you're on the the first thing what we're going to oh, do, yeah. uh, right. uh, we need to sort it out chocolates. Who likes chocolates? I do. You're okay, a big so fan. you come here then. Okay, yeah. Yes. I've got so you can chop my up my chocolate there. Yes. Uh, not too fine, not too uh, big, medium. Right. Uh, oh God. Uh, you just need to peel all these bananas <laughs> as fast, <laughs> as quick as you can. I've got, oh, a... got to peel bananas. I know, I know, I know. I've got a little knife because it makes it easy. Look, you do the cuts like that, and then right. if you have to, but I need them quite quickly. Oh, right. Uh, okay, so what I got? The first thing I'm going to make a, a caramel, okay, for my tart, which is very simple. I go uh, butter goes in there, okay, like that. Now, don't start to tell me this is fattening, yeah? <laughs> Are these too big? 
cake. Do you want a small? Oh, yeah, yeah, no, smaller, oh, smaller, God. smaller. And All then right. I'm going to put a, a, a little bit of sugar just to start the caramel. Mel, right. what I want you from you on this side, uh -huh. I've got puff pastry. Yeah. If you can make the puff, puff pastry oh, go in God. where the oh, chopping board yeah. is, <laughs> this one, so if so, you can roll it out yeah, for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, then what I, what I got, I got some uh, uh, mixed nut almonds. Uh, um, oh, well, you know, that. walnuts, you know, anything. Oh, if you no. go hazelnut, whatever you got, yeah. just roughly chop them and we're going to toast them in a dry pan. All right, like that. Right. You know, girls, that you made me a very cool uh, daddy yesterday. Oh, when yeah? When I told really? my boys that <laughs> I was cooking with the uh, Saturdays, they went all mental. Oh. Yes, 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 How yes. How old are they? Uh, Luciano is 11 and Rocco is 8. Oh, no. Yes. And that Luciano's is got one of your posters in his room and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, yeah, you. he's a little pervert, so... <laughs> start somewhere <laughs> so okay so the caramel is ready <laughs> I just said it. the caramel is ready bananas no, are good no, no, very good you oh, need I, to I the other end up. Yeah, yeah, just take the black you know the star and then this uh, string uh, here yeah. Oh, yeah. then if you come here oh. if you come here I'm gonna show you what to do <laughs> you just pour the banana okay yes. around the uh, around the dish if you can nice. do that right, until okay. you complete the circle this is beautiful. Okay. Now, one thing that we need to be careful whenever we uh, roll out pastry, that I need the pastry slightly larger than the diameter of the uh, pan. So where do I put it here? Just mm -hmm. to give me an idea. Okay, mm -hmm. take the corners off. That we should be okay. It, Can you carry on on the dish? Yeah. Yeah. Is it shortcut pastry? No, 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 say? this is puff pastry. It's puff pastry. So what I do, I take the, the rounded edges off. Slowly, slowly when you put them in, because it's caramel, it gets very hot, yeah? Okay. All right. And then if you don't like bananas, you can always do them with the uh, apple. Yeah. Apple we do, or peaches. I like peaches, mm, when it's the time like. for the peaches. Let's see, then you can break them and put okay. in the middle. I think we had one banana uh, Yeah, Did we you have eat one banana? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> have you done all the bananas? Out. No, I've done them all. Okay. That's all right. Well, let's <laughs> pretend that this is covered with all bananas. <laughs> <laughs> How can we be on a cookery show, a banana show? Oh, <laughs> okay, then oh, we go, uh, the chocolate chip, they oh, go on top. No, yeah. Okay, yeah, you can carry on. Can you do can this. do that for me. Yeah. Go on, Molly. All right. Getting see, involved. as you can see, it's pretty easy so far, right? Yeah, so far. Okay, so just good. put it there. So, Molly, is it true you like watching cooking shows? Yes. But you're not really into actually <laughs> no, doing it. No, I love watching them, and then it gets my appetite up, and then I'm like, right, which takeaway am I going to order? <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yes. Well, most of the people, they're like you, to be honest with you. Everybody say, oh, I like the cooking show. Yeah, like they're cooking, very relaxing to watch, yeah. aren't they? They're I mean, so they're relaxing, aren't they? Yeah, they I feel like a housewife it watching it. But, <laughs> yeah. Now, what's happened at this stage, now is where you have to be careful because right. we have to put uh, um, oh. the pastry on top. But remember that the pan is hot. Mm -hmm. So the way you do it, you put it like that, it goes on top, and then what you do, you tuck the side of the uh, pastry, uh -huh. Uh -huh. you know, all around the banana. Okay? Just like that. Just right. like you would tuck a little baby in this duvet thing. <laughs> okay? Like that. Now, there is no uh, need to brush you anything like that. Okay. The oven preheated 200 oh, degrees okay. wow. for 25 minutes. Right. Okay? And this is the one we prepared earlier. Oh, I love that. Okay, <laughs> okay now, to wow. do this, now, to put this one together, you're going to have to be very careful. Get a plate that is larger than the pan, uh -huh. and you need to be very, very quick, okay? Right. So you do it again, you give it a good shake, oh. and now is the time you start to pray yeah. that everything is okay. <laughs> Then you put it upside oh down. Ooh, ooh, has it happened? Look Whoa. at that. Okay. Now I'm going to put the crushed nuts on top because this is going to give a, a, an extra oh, nice. crunch. Yeah. Look at that. How easy is to do it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's brilliant okay. as well. Then uh, oh. uh, we got the ice cream. If I can have yeah, two bowls of ice cream. Yeah. The way to serve it is very, very simple. You just uh, see. If it was at my house, I would have put yeah. this in the middle of the table and get the guests get on with it. Uh, uh, <laughs> but if you really want to do it, just get yourself a nice sharp knife like this one, okay? Oh. A good slice. Good. Now, you can imagine the caramel and the chocolate yeah, and the yes. crushed nuts, all these beautiful flavors coming together. Oh. Make sure, by the way, that the bananas Ooh, are not too cooked. Okay. Right. Okay? Not too cooked, not too uh, uh, ripe. Because uh, what's happening, okay. if they wrap, they're going to get mushy. I don't like yeah, mushy right. bananas. No, no. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs>
And this is how you, how you make my non-mushy banana, <laughs> sticky banana, and chocolate tart. You made that look so easy. It is easy. It is easy. Mm. easy. Mm. It yeah. does look a bit difficult, to be fair. See, when I'm going <laughs> to come to your tour, then what I'm going to also throw it in is private cookery lessons. Oh, <laughs> yes, that's what we need from Yes, I know, I know, I know, I know. I think I definitely mm. got the Maybe job. Maybe it's too much money. What do you think? Is now, the good? cold oh, ice well. cream going with the hot mm -hmm. banana and chocolate. Like this it? is the experience. Yes. Oh, my God. Another winner, Gina. Well done. Another winner. Thank you. Welcome back to Let's Do Lunch. Molly and Vanessa from the Saturdays are still winners. Are you enjoying yourself? We oh, are. We're loving it. We really are. <laughs> yeah, I well, love the lesson you. over there. Yeah, it's yeah, interesting yeah, stuff, it is. isn't it? Yeah. You're never going to invite him again. <laughs> Gino didn't like it much. <laughs> He's boring. That's going to be a boring wedding. You can't do this, you can't do that. <laughs> Now, you've been voting for which dish you want Gino to cook next. Yes, and you have to choose between spicy prawns with chorizo and herbs or a summer fish pie. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised about this because I thought that the uh, fish pie would win, but 54% of you want to see the spicy so prawns. It's close. Well, it's close. It was very close. Yes. Surprised because whenever you say fish pie to people, they love it. Yeah. yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. OK, before we're going to move on and show you how to make the spicy prawns, I'm just going to show you how to prepare the uh, prawns. Right. OK? Mm -hmm. yeah. So I'm going to show you, usually whenever you get a fresh prawns, it looks like this, yes. mm -hmm. with the uh, head and the tail and all the yeah. skin. The first thing I'm going to do is to uh, peel it. Okay? Right. So, girls, have you ever done this before? No. No? Well, no. OK, <laughs> go okay. join in. First thing, you get the prawns. OK, like that. Mm -hmm. You take his head off. Take the, oh, yeah. God. Yeah, there is just not, pull it off. There is not a gentle way to do it. You just yeah. have to What's all that yellow stuff? Poo -poo. Brain, isn't it? Poo-poo and brain. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's OK, it's all part of the food. Put it here. <laughs> then, that with your off. finger, with your finger, what you're going to have to do? Start with the, uh, sh the first part oh, of the shell, yeah. yeah? Right. And just peel it off. But be gentle. Remember, little prawns is gentle because if you push it too hard, what's going to happen? You're going to break into break. the flesh. OK? Right. Oh, right. Then look what's happened. Oh, very, very easily. All the side goes away. And the last thing that you do with the tail, you squeeze it. Oh, bloop, no. And it comes off. I'm having a nightmare here. I can't get Let's past have a look. the first part. Oh. Put your nails it, underneath. You know where the legs oh, are? Yeah. You get your fingers in between its legs. I'm just happy. Look, your finger <laughs> needs to be here. <laughs> Uh, underneath, <laughs> underneath here. Oh, here we go. And then you just peel it off. Oh, I yeah, see. I beep, beep, you know, yeah, that's it. You've right. done it. Beautiful. Yeah. Okay? You've got to get stuck in there, though. You really yeah. do yeah. have to get stuck. And then we're going to squeeze the tail and uh, it comes off. Right. Is it important to get all squeeze of the. It. I'm pretty trying. The brain out. <laughs> right. Ooh. Have you done it? Yeah, you Are cut you the prawn in half. <laughs> <It's okay. laughs> You squeeze it, oh, can you see? You squeeze yeah. it and then it comes off. There That's okay, is. don't worry about right, it. I'm okay. going to show you how to devein a prawn. Oh, okay? oh no. Okay? Sharp knife, you yeah. pull your prawns like this, then put on the chopping board and make a little cut on the side of the back. Okay? Right. You will see that there is a vein right here. Okay, this one here. Oh, I've not... Oh, God. Okay. Can you see it, girls? And the only thing you have to do... Let me see. Look at that. There you go. Yeah. Can you see it? Oh, God, yeah, I can. All right, yeah. so that, you oh, take the vein out, and the job is this is how you uh, devein them. Very, very simple. OK. Yeah. Otherwise, go to, the, uh, go to the fishmonger, get him to do it. <laughs> yeah, right? that's what I would that's do. That's what you want to do. OK. Yeah. Well, you, you got more practice to do it here. OK, if you, if you can do me a favour, I've got a little yes. bit oh, of parsley gosh. that it needs to be uh, oh, chopped this, up. Oh, this is better for me. I'm not sure yeah. about leaving me over here with the prawns. No, that's no, OK. I'm leaving you with all these prawns to do. <laughs> OK? And if you can put them in a bowl for me, then. I can't find the stain, okay. but I think he's all right. It's OK. He's there somewhere. Now, right. um, for the spicy <laughs> prawns with chorizo, very, very simple. The first oh. thing we're going to have to do is how to cook the rice, yeah. as I said before. To cook the rice is simple. We go uh, um, chicken stock here, that it goes straight into the pan. Then you put all the rice in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So put the so chicken first. Cold yeah. stock. Just, uh, just the way you're cold. It can be warm. It doesn't really matter. All right. Then you put the uh, rice, goes on top. Like this, as you can see, the stock is double of the uh, amount of the rice. OK. You just stir it, squeeze the lemon. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, don't worry about the peeps, it's fine. Are you sure? Yeah, then put the skin in there. Yeah. Okay, then a pinch of salt. 
At this point, what you do, very simple. You take it to the boil for five minutes. Ah. Once the five minutes are gone, you switch it off, put the lid on top, and you just allow the rice to absorb the liquid. So you never have to look at it. You don't I have to do anything else. No, 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 no. This is the it. easiest way to do it. Five and look what you get. Perfect nice and fluffy fluffy. rice. If you move it around, you can show people nice yeah, and fluffy. Let me take that lemon out. Okay, how do we do this one? Uh, we put a little bit of olive oil in a, a, a frying pan. Are you okay with the parsley? Can I have it finally chopped? Right. Yes. Um, <laughs> then we're going to put um, <laughs> sliced red onions. They go in there. You can the sizzle there straight away. Then we're going to put chili flakes and uh, smoked paprika. Beautiful. This is where the hot comes from. Mel, can you give it a stir for me, please? I can do. Smoked yeah. paprika, is that easy to get? Let me show you the way to do it. Yeah, I know. To get, I can get them very fine. I'll tell you how to do it. You put right. the blade on the chopping board. Yeah. One hand on the handle. Yeah. The other hand goes on top of the knife. And the right. only thing you have to do is go up and down. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. That's it. Up and down. And then you can be like a television chef. You can talk to people. Yeah, they yeah. always do that. Yeah. Yeah. You, can, uh, you can show off because your hands are always safe. Right. Let's try. OK, I'm going to give this a go. Yeah, no, the finger. Oh, That's no. it. That's yeah. it. That's it. Then talk to me. Yeah, what's going down? <laughs> How cool does it look? Believe me, you look much better than me. <laughs> Just put everything together like that, and that's fine. Right. Now, for the chorizo, okay. uh, I'm using chorizo that uh, uh, um, is ideal for cooking, which is slightly softer, OK? What's happening? Is that too hot, that pan? Uh, I'm worried uh, about these. No, just uh, put burning. it down a little bit. No, don't worry about it, because what I want, that is not burnt. It's caramelised. Oh, yeah, of course. Um, I should know that by now. <laughs> Now, of course, there is the one that is already made there, so the one I'm just going to give you the idea of how to do it. You okay. chop up your chorizo. Can I just ask you about goes... the smoked paprika? Can you buy that? Is it easy to buy? Because when you say it, it's always paprika, it doesn't say smoke necessarily. Is it easy to get hold of? It's fine, yes. Is it? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, you put it there. Now, one thing that you have to do, I've got my prawns ready here. Oh, Okay, oh. these, they're going to go straight into the tomato sauce because prawns, the worst thing you can do is to overcook them. Yes. So they go straight in there. And make sure this will take approximately about a minute and a half to two minutes to do it. So don't don't panic, okay? okay. Because right. what's happened is they turn into like they a pink strong. color, and uh, uh, that means that it's ready. Okay. The worst thing you can do to prawns if you overcook them, they become very chewy. Okay. But do they not go smaller? Because I've made that slightly mistake Slightly smaller. Before. They do I've go slightly smaller. Now, the onion, the chorizo, everything is in oh, there. Goodness. We're going to pour a little bit of white wine. Okay. Like Oh. Of course, whenever you put wine, make sure that uh, the alcohol evaporates. Right. And it evaporates when the bubbles, they're going on there. Okay. Once the bubbles are done for about a minute or so, then you put your tinned cherry tomatoes. Beautiful. Mm. And you just leave it to cook for 10, 15 minutes, and that's what you're going to get. Oh, yeah. So very, very simple. Lovely. Now, make sure that the prawns, you toss them around like this. Mel, can you do me a favor? Can you try the sauce if it needs a little bit of salt okay. for me? Now, it parsley. Smells good. Can you can you give me a nice? Is it all right to oh, yeah. test the sauce when the prawns are yes. half done? Yes, okay. yes, 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 yes. Here you go. Yeah, just sprinkle it around. No, the other one. Yeah, the one. one. Well, that, yes. do, that doesn't need anything. Ooh. Does it need anything? Nah. That's it. Can you give it a good stir for me? Yeah. 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 Thank you. Problem. Come here. Come here. Come yeah. here. Come here. Right. Now, what we want to do here, we oh, just the way to do it, you put the rice. On Ooh. the bottom of the uh, plate. Oh my god, this looks so yummy. Like it smells, it smells good. It's so good. good. It's so and good. And then you just get your prawns. Oh. You put them on top. Look how beautiful oh, it is. Oh, yeah. Okay. Right, let me get some uh, forks. And out what I'm going to do, girls, girls oh. I'm just going to put a little bit more parsley on top. Okay. Right. Can I use this tea towel? Of course you yeah, can. Yeah, go for it. And girl. this is how you make <laughs> spicy prawns <laughs> with chorizo and you. I'm going to bring it here for you. Okay. Right, check oh, in. Let us know God. what you think. Okay. Now, very important. Uh, is anyone who wants to come and try? Come, yes. come down, come down. You, you, come down here. Yeah, yeah, sir, come down here. Don't worry about it. This is a big less lunch party. <laughs> oh, my God, I quickly, can see 10 quickly, people quickly, coming down. down. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Quickly, but don't mm. fall down the stairs. Mm -hmm. yeah, come down. Come, oh, well, whatever you want. This way, fine. That's it. That's oh, all right. This is That's so a big one. What's your name? This is lovely. Uh, Angela. Angela, go for it. What's your name? Daniel, you. Daniel, go for it. Daniel. Daniel. Alana, go for it. Alana. That's a big one. Have you called all these people here? Cheryl. Cheryl, go for it. Lita. Lita, go for it. I've only got a spoon for you. Yes, go for it. And a spoon for you. What is that? Oh, 
Try, try, try. Yummy. Oh, all right, that's it for today. All the recipes are on our website as well as details of how you can get involved in the show. Big thanks to the lovely Molly King and Vanessa White. Thank you, girls. Today. Tomorrow, the hilarious Ryan Clark will be right here. Join us tomorrow at 12.30. Ciao.